Hey guys, this is Lala Legacy with another episode of Emily is Away 2. So, we did the first chapter last time, and now we're on chapter 2, which is autumn of 2006. So, chapter 1 was also 2006, but it was in the summer. So, if there is no love in the world, we will make a new world. We will give it walls and knocker that or and a knocker that resonates so softly that we will never hear it. Jonathan Saffron Foer. I don't know if I pronounced that last name right, but that's okay. So it's senior year, October 13th. Okay. Oh my god, Ugg boots. No. Ugh. <laughs> Alright, cheeseburger, no. Um, the wire, no. No, 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 no. Casino Royale, yes. Oh, wait. Ah, oh, my chemical romance. Yes. Oh, excuse me. Let's do Snow Patrol. Take my hand, not your fingers through mine. We'll walk from this dark room for the last time. Uh, let's do... Final Destination 3. Death is fucking complicated. And the best is yet to come. There. Uh, hey! Hey, Lala, what's up? Um... Some homework. Just some homework. You. Oh my. Lala, how is you? Pretty tired. How are you? Not too much. Got home from Kelly's a little while ago. What did you. Oh, that's cool. What do you two do? Uh, same. Hey, do you know what today is? Leaf Erickson Day! No. Oh shit, is it Leaf Erickson Day? No, it's Friday the 13th. Good thing we're not counselors. Good thing we're not camp counselors. Shit, my mom's calling me for dinner, but I'll be on later. Talk to you then? Okay, see ya! Okay, I'll see you later. Bye! LOL, pretty much. What are you going to do to celebrate? Black magic? <laughs> Definitely some black magic. You? Yo, same! I'm so happy it's fall. It's like my favorite season. Um, yeah, mine too. Hey! mine do are you gonna dress up for Halloween uh, I hadn't thought about it I hadn't thought about it are you like I'm answering these honestly because dear god I have not dressed up for Halloween in forever but I also haven't been cosplaying in a long time either so that's kind of yeah yeah, I am. Jackie's or Jackie's having a big Halloween party. I'm looking at costumes now. What do you think I should go as? Uh, Alice in Wonderland. How about Alice in Wonderland? Whoa, no way. I was actually trying to decide between Alice in Wonderland and Sally from Nightmare Before Christmas. I'm not going to actually look at them. I'm just going to say go with Alice. Which do you think is better? Alice. I think I like Al the Alice costume the most. That's what I was thinking. I'll go pick it up tomorrow. Jackie's parties are always crazy. You could probably expect more drunk texts. Hey, I'm down. <laughs> Just try to spell better this time. I think I have some of those locked on my phone for or from the summer. LOL. I don't know how you understood any of them. 
Um, I'm that good. You know, I'm just that good. <laughs> LOL, like this one. OMG, we thinks Jackie's roof die now and starts never flooded so beautiful. Uh, stars never look so beautiful. You got it! Damn, I'm impressed. LOL. Hey, maybe you could just come to the party. Do you drink? Uh, no. Not really. Nah, I don't like drinking. Oh, cool, cool. That's probably smart. Do you, like, care if people around you are drinking? Uh, don't think so. I guess not. I don't think so. I mean, as long as they're not getting, like, shit-faced drunk and being stupid to me, then I don't mind. Well, if you want, or if you want to, you're, invite to, or you're invited to come out and play. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. We'll see. The only rule is you have to dress up. What would you go as? I'd go as the Mad Hatter. <laughs> maybe I'll go as the Mad Hatter. Or something. Oh. The send thing didn't pop up, so... That'd be awesome, Sauce. We'll take a picture or some pictures together. I'll add you to the event page. Oh, wait. Are we friends on Facebook? I don't know. I don't know. No? Then friend me when you get a chance, yo. Uh, Halloween party? <laughs> you plan to attend the Halloween party? <laughs> LOL, yeah, Jackie's a tool, obviously. So, what are you up to? Some homework. <laughs> Just some homework, you? <laughs> Just listening to music. <laughs> Census Fail just came out with a new album. Uh, you must be excited. Oh, cool. You must be excited. It's been on repeat all day. No, thank you. This song and the next one are my favorite. Uh, awesome sauce. Oh, this is awesome sauce? No, it's not. I'm so glad you like the same music as me. I don't! Seriously, you're pretty swell. Uh, you're swell too. You're pretty swell too. I really like talking to you. I'm glad we're friends. Yeah, I'm glad we're friends. I'm really glad we sat next to each other in history last year, lol. Although I feel like there's a lot about you I still don't know. I'm an open book. Hey, I'm an open book. Me too. I have an idea. Let's play a game. I get to ask you a question about whatever, then you get to ask a question. Sounds fun. I used to do this all the time. And just ask what comes to mind first. If you take too long, it'll just be my turn again. Are you ready? Uh, ready as I'll ever be. Alright, here we go. I'll start with an easy one. Do you remember my favorite kind of movie? Horror. It was horror, right? Yep, yep, I knew you'd remember. Now it's your turn, quick. Uh, favorite dessert. Hmm, what's your favorite dessert? Brownies and ice cream. Oh my god, now I'm hungry. 
Let's see, have you ever snuck out of your house? No, actually. Nope. My parents would kill me if I did that. LOL. Oh yeah, I definitely understand that. Your turn again. Done any drugs? Have you ever done any drugs? Just weed, but I kind of like the idea of experimenting. Eww. Alright, let's get serious. Do you have a crush on anyone? Um, I don't know yet. Kind of don't know just yet. I know I don't like you. Oh, scandalous. I wonder who it is. I know what I'm asking next. Uh, have you ever had your heart broken? And if yes, by who? Unfair, that's like two questions in one. That's legal! It's a mini follow-up. That shit's legal. You're a cheater, but I'll answer both. I guess. It's kind of a long story. I got time. I got all the time in the world. The short answer is yes. I've been heartbroken. Steve Myers. You know him, right? Fake ID guy? Yeah, me and him dated for a lot of my sophomore and junior year. It got pretty serious, and I definitely think I loved him. Then, he was going off to college, so he broke up with me last winter. Are you okay? That's rough. Are you okay? Oh yeah, it's more just confusing than anything. Like, I'm getting over him. It's just weird, lol. Are you off and on? Are you, like, off and on? Nah, definitely not. It's just that the feelings still hang around. When it worked, we were a really good couple. Did he love you? That's the big question. Yeah, I think he did. Like, he was the first person I ever had sex with. Oh my god, having sex with somebody doesn't mean that they love you. I'm literally, like, holding my face right now. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you? Just because somebody has sex with you does not mean that they love you. It could mean that they just wanted you for sex and that was it. That they thought that, oh yeah, this girl has a rockin' body, or yeah, this boy has a rockin' body. Let's get together, and I'll say that I'm in a relationship with them, but really, all I want is their B or their D. And it's like, no, fuck you. Ugh. Feelings for other people? Do you have any feelings for other people? I mean, I had like a fling this past summer. But nothing as serious as Steve, obviously. Uh, with who? A fling? With who? Brian. I don't think you know him. We fooled around, but like, it was fun. Not serious, you know? Lala, if you don't mind me asking, have you ever had sex? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I have. That's what I thought. So, you understand what I mean. Lust versus love. Exactly. Yes. Yeah, lust versus love and all that. Not a lot of people know, but me and Steve have these plans for the for our future. So, being together felt like a big deal. Um, like, same college? <laughs> like, going to the same college, or what? And even then, if they're making plans with you like that, it doesn't mean that they love you. It, like, it's... 
uh, it's possible that they're using that as a manipulation tactic to be like, hey, I don't want to lose this person because one, they're good to me. Two, I could do whatever the heck I want. Three, they're smoking hot, so why would I want to lose that? So, like, yeah, they could be talking out of their freaking ass about, like, making plans with you, and it's not going to go anywhere. You have to know that this person actually loves you. <laughs> like, some people might tell me that my ex didn't love me because of what his family and him did to me at the end, but no, I know that he did because... For one, what man is going to break down and cry in front of his girlfriend's family about her health if he didn't love her? What man would break down and cry in front of her family? Ugh, this is making me angry. <laughs> it's gonna sound really stupid, don't judge me, okay? No judgment. Come on, Evelyn, no judgment here. So yeah, I thought we'd go to the same college, or, yeah, I thought we'd go to the same college together, and then maybe, I don't know, get married, start a family, whatever. That's not stupid. It's never wrong to want something. That's right. It just feels silly now, thinking about it. But I think that's why it's been hard to get over the breakup. That plan doesn't need Steve. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know, that future doesn't need Steve. I know, and I still want that future even without Steve. But maybe that's silly. That's a great plan. I think that's a great plan. And still, definitely in reach. I just think people think it's stupid when I talk about it. Well, fuck those people. Yeah! You can do whatever you want. That's right. Thanks, Lala. You've really made me feel a lot better. What are your plans after college? Do you want a family? <laughs> no, I don't think so. I kind of want to be free to do whatever for a while. Oh, cool. Yeah, I feel a lot of people feel that way. Hey, I just remembered. It's still my turn to ask you a question. <laughs> We're still playing? <laughs> what? We're still playing? Oh, here's a good one. Would you ever date someone like me? Um, I don't know. LOL, I don't know. I, uh, maybe? Probably not. Oh, uh, or no, LOL, alright. Your turn, last question, don't fuck it up. Uh, are you tired? <laughs> uh, are you getting tired? I don't want to ask her about dating because I would never date a pot smoker. Oh, uh, not really, but I guess it is getting late. And I still want to shower before bed. Time flies! Seriously, time flies. I know, seriously. I'm gonna go, but tonight was really fun. We should do this again. Good night, Lala! Good night, Evelyn. I know who I was when I got up this morning, but I think I must have been changed several times since then. Alice. That's right. Hey, sorry about that. You left me. I can't believe you just leave me like that. <laughs> Oh, you're fine. <laughs> so what were we talking about? Oh, Kelly's. Yeah, she showed me this site on Facenook. Do you know about it? Or er, do you know it? Uh, like MySpace? Is that like MySpace? 
Kind of, but with way less gifts. I'm setting up my profile now. There's just so many questions. Uh, questions like what? Oh, really? Questions like what? Your favorite this, your favorite that, and I have to write a status now? What should I write? Emily is the best. Haha, <laughs> that's definitely what I should use. There, it's finally done. I bet it's awesome. Cool, I bet it's awesome. Don't make fun of it. As she sends me a link. <laughs> nice status. Hey, nice status. Haha, <laughs> yeah, I thought you'd like that. You should send me a friend request when you get the chance. Will do. So, what are you up to tonight? Just going to stay in, probably stay up late. Haha, <laughs> sounds like me. Oh, if seeing is believing, then believe that we have lost our eyes. Don't worry, I'm still here. Hiding from someone? Are you hiding from someone? <laughs> you caught me. I just don't want to talk to some people. <laughs> do I have to beat someone up? Exactly. Oh no, do I have to beat someone up? <laughs> me! <laughs> no! <laughs> just just kind of being an ass. I never liked him. You know, I never really did like him. Haha, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'm being bitchy tonight or something. Uh, excuse me? You seem fine. I mean, you seem fine. What do you say? I can send you the chat log. Just don't show anyone, okay? I promise. Of course, I promise I won't. Alright, accept the file. Did you get it? Okay guys, so I did look and it's really not there. Can you link it? Can you just send me a link? That work? Let me see. All right, it's loading. Here we go. So, hey, Emily. Hey, what's up? Not much. You? Nothing much. So, when are you coming over? I don't know if I can tonight. I have a lot of homework to do. You can just do it here. It's like projects, your project kind of stuff. I really don't think I can come. Oh, come on, Emily. We had this plan all week. I know, I'm sorry. Are you really not going to come over? I had a whole night planned for us. I don't think I can. Holy shit, are you serious? What the fuck, Emily? Look, I'm okay. Or, I'm sorry, okay? I told you that it might not work out. I didn't think you were fucking serious. Well, I was. I really can't believe you. I think I'm going to go. Sure, whatever. Wow. He's a dick. Jeff is a fucking dick. So do you think I was out of line? Fuck, definitely not. You should be able to do whatever you want. Yeah, exactly. You even told him that it might not work out. Yeah, I just don't want to go over tonight. Sometimes... It's just hard being there. I understand. Yeah, I understand what you mean. He's a fucking dick. Thanks. Uh, sometimes I just need a break. The problem's solved, though, because I can just fake being away and talk to you. Uh, I'm always here for you. Yeah, 
Just know that I'm always here for you. That's right. Thanks, Lala. Hey, random question. Do you remember my favorite games? RPGs! Oh yeah, role-playing games, right? Whoa, you remembered! I'm impressed! How could I forget? Do you remember mine? It's RPGs too, of course I remember! Correctamundo! You know me! And you know me! Hey, let's listen to some... Siger Ross together. Don't know them. I don't think I know them. They're Icelandic. I really love this album. Hey, this is great! Yeah! Thumbs up. Yay, let's listen to the album together! I have no idea what the lyrics mean, but their music always makes me feel happy. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's really beautiful. Isn't it? My or This song, Hippipola, is my favorite. Hey, cool beans, you put Snow Patrol lyrics in your info. Well, I really like them. Yeah, I really like them. Hey, me too! We're the same! You have some pretty good taste in music. So do you. So, have you started applying to colleges? Oh yeah, definitely. I actually was, like, by my freshman year, already applying for colleges. I started applying this summer. Oh wow, you're on the ball! <laughs> I haven't really started yet. Where were you looking to go, really? Anywhere. Anywhere that'll take me, lol you. I don't know, I'd really love to go to school in the city. Oh, sorry guys, I'm yawning. And I've always thought it would be really cool to live in New York. Uh, expensive? <laughs> oh geez, I bet that'll be expensive. Yeah! Depends on where you live. I think I really just want to get out of here and go someplace totally new, you know? I feel the same. That's exactly how I did feel when I was in high school. Do you want to stay in, in New York after college? Yeah, I think that could be really grand. But I don't know, planning that far out can be a little silly. I mean, yeah, I guess. It's good to have a plan, though. Sometimes it's good to have a plan, though. Yeah, but so much is unknown, you know? And I really don't see myself settling down anytime soon. Like right now, I honestly don't even see myself having kids. <laughs> like, ever? Not having kids, like, ever? I mean, I don't know. I don't think so. I just want to be able to take life as it comes, I think. Good philosophy. Yeah, that's a really good philosophy to have. I think so. Hopefully it works out. How about you after college? Do you want to settle down, like, right after? Definitely not. Nope. Definitely not. Taking life as it comes sounds pretty good. More like, after college, you probably won't find a job in your field, so why start a family when you can't even hardly support yourself? Cool beans. I'm so glad you think the same way I do. And if you move to New York, too, maybe we'll be roommates. <laughs> no tiny apartment! You can't live in a tiny apartment, then. Haha, <laughs> true. Thanks for letting me talk about it. Whenever I talk about New York with Jeff, he always gets so upset. Uh, why does he get upset? 
what? Why does he get upset? I guess he doesn't want me to go far away. But I think he knows I'd go without him. <laughs> he seems like an ass. Yes. Honestly, he seems like an ass. Sometimes, maybe. He's going through a really tough time. No, that is no excuse. He just wants to be a more serious couple. Yeah, and hold you back? No. Do you want that? Or do you want to be more serious? I think it's pretty personal, so you can't tell anyone, okay? Of course not. I won't tell anyone. Me and Jeff haven't had sex. And that's okay! I think he wanted to try tonight or something. His parents aren't home. Uh, yeah, don't do it to make him happy. Exactly. Exactly! Oh, I would never. I'm just not ready for that with him. But it's okay. It's not like he's ever tried anything. It's just kind of an... Or it's just kind of annoying to keep turning him down. Wait until you're ready, that's right. Just wait until you're ready. It's okay to not want to, that's right. Yeah, but sometimes I feel weird, like I should have done it by now. Ha, ah, screw that! Nah, screw that. Fuck shoulds, er, wait, what? Fuck shoulds. It's your life. Thanks, Lala. If you don't mind me asking, have you had sex? Yeah, I have. Oh, cool. Well, thanks for talking with me about it. <laughs> I charge by the minute. <laughs> You're lucky I don't charge by the minute. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> I'm sorry I stole so much of your night just talking about random stuff. It's been nice. Honestly, it's been nice. Yeah, it has been. I really like talking to you about stuff. I feel like we're different now, but in a good way. Um, we're really, no, I feel that way too. Hey, I feel like we're different too. Can I ask you a kind of personal question? Yeah, of course. Why aren't you in a relationship? Just waiting. Just waiting for the right person, I guess. That's right. Yeah, you seem like such a great catch. <laughs> Even for you? <laughs> a good catch? Oh, come on. You're such a good friend. No! Screw that! You say what you think. Hey, what did you just delete? A good catch for you? I was asking if I was a good catch for you? That's right, be honest. I mean, from my perspective, you've been in serious relationships and I haven't. But alternative music is your favorite. And we have the same outlook on life. Like... If I was single, <laughs> you're a really great person, okay? You should just know that. You're great too, Emily. <laughs> I like when you use my name, but I think we should figure out a nickname. M. How about M? M? I like it. Do you want me to call you something besides Lala? Uh, no thanks. No thank you. Okay then. Oh man, I think I need to get off the computer now. Bedtime? 
Is it bedtime? Nah, my mom needs to look at emails or something. I'll miss you. Okay, I'll miss you. I'll miss you too. <laughs> Thanks again for everything tonight. Anytime. Hey, anytime. Exactly. I, or I'll talk to you again soon, okay? <laughs> you better! <laughs> yeah, you better! Aww! It's a little heart! Little less than three! Oh, you can now sign up! Hey! Alright, well, I guess that's the end of chapter two, guys. So, if you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up down below, and if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button too, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!